Good evening, viewers. Let's take you directly now to the residence of the Chief Minister of Jharkhand, Heman Soren. Section 144 imposed what we are getting in. Arrest any time, any moment. Heman Soren's arrest by the Enforcement Directorate now imminent. We are expecting an arrest to be made any time now. The ED that questioned him over six straight hours, not happy uh, with the line of questioning. Also, uh, you know, the sequence of events come at the back of uh, dramatic events that took place over the last 48 hours where at one point of time the ED did not know where Heman Soren was or at least the press could not find him but uh, having said that where Heman Soren comes into question in all probability word coming in that he will be arrested any time soon section 144 has been imposed around 100 meters of his house the ED has been probing him in at least three cases linked to Benami properties, illegal mining. Having said that, the summon that was issued today was on land scan where the ED is probing uh, what they claim is a huge racket of illegal change of ownership of land by the mafia in Jharkhand. Um, and uh, the ED claims, is what our source is telling us, that repeated questions that were asked of Heman Soren, the answers to those questions have not been to the satisfaction of the ED. And arrest now imminent. Uh, this also pertains to PMLA uh, Act, which would mean that uh, the Chief Minister of Jharkhand would be in ED custody for the next 14 days. Uh, PMLA also will suggest that uh, it would be a while before Heman Soren will be released. But what we are getting in right now is that an arrest is imminent, viewers, any time now. Uh, cutting across to Munish Pandey, Munish Pandey, who's joining us from the studio, Shreya Chatterjee, who's joining us from Rachi, as well as Anupam, getting us the latest in terms of what could be the political fallout. Munish, you getting us the news. Your source is telling you it's any time now. Heman Soren could be arrested by the ED any moment where the land scam case is concerned. Absolutely, Preeti, and what I have been given to understand by my sources within Rachi and, and in the ED headquarters in the national capital that uh, it's only formality left, and any time from now, on paper, he will be shown as arrest. This is what our sources are telling us at this point of time. Now, as far as the questioning was concerned, remember, he was questioned since uh, 1.30 this afternoon, and during the questioning, he was uh, um, asked about the land scam case, Apart from land scam case, he was also asked about uh, the illegal mining and the coal scam case also. But what sources are saying that uh, when he was uh, questioned regarding these scams, he was unable to defend himself. He was unable to give satisfactory answers to the uh, uh, ED officials. And that is why, based on the documentary evidence which they have collected during the course of investigation, they have decided to arrest him and Soren. But even at this point of time, uh, you know, officially he is still being questioned, uh, Preeti. That is what we can confirm. But uh, sources are saying that, uh, you know, he will be arrested because there are huge amount of evidence against him and Soren and that is why there is a meeting also which is going on in the national right. capital of top ED officials uh, at this point of time. All right, you know, there, there are lots of implications to that as well. Now, who will be the next chief minister of Jharkhand? Because once again, viewers, let's not miss this point. This is historic. This is history in the making. For the first time, a sitting chief minister of a state will be arrested by the enforcement directorate. Uh, earlier on, there have been occasions uh, where chief ministers were arrested, but they did step down before that arrest. So this is history in the making in that respect. Who will take over as the next chief minister? Word has it, it could very well be. Uh, Kalpana Soren, Heban Soren's wife, you're going to get back to that uh, with Anupam. But Shreya, with what uh, Munish is telling us right now, the final hour of questioning at play, in all probability, we're going to be seeing an arrest being made. And the visuals around you right now, around the Chief Minister's residence, seem to suggest the same. Section 144 of the CRPC <coughs> implemented of a 100-meter diameter around the Chief Minister's residence. There's a huge security beef up which has been called by the Enforcement Directorate. They've asked for extra forces. What are you witnessing around you in just in terms of security, uh, you know, bolstering movement that seems to suggest that an arrest is imminent. 
but Preeti, uh, the visuals are screaming about an imminent arrest, and that's been happening since the day was proceeding uh, when the enforcement director team appeared at the residence of the Jharkhand Chief Minister, which is the Kake Road. Now, I'll ask my cameraman to just give you the visuals over here. You can understand that this entire stretch has been cordoned off, which is why there is no vehicular movement and all the senior authorities, including the DGP, the IG, uh, the DC, the commissioner, everyone is right now inside. Uh, there were also time and again uh, announcements being made to ensure that people do not, uh, uh, I mean, uh, break the section 144 that is uh, in place. We also do understand that the possible question that comes uh, to the mind of people that whether someone uh, of the position of a sitting chief minister who is in a very powerful uh, place can be arrested. But what we do know that the Article 361 of the Constitution only grants such immunity to the president uh, and the governor of the country. Uh, from a civil or a criminal arrest. But apart from that, we do not see any immunity being enjoyed by the sitting chief ministers as well. So ED has to prove that he was evasive, he's in possibility of hostiling the witnesses in the case, and he will probably destroy evidence. So three things that the ED will have to prove. One, we already know that when they went ahead and carried out that searches in uh, the uh, Delhi residence of the enforcement directorate, they already source-based information shared that Heman Surin is missing. That proves that he was evasive. So ED sorts of has a case for the court and they have incriminating evidence is what they are suggesting so far as his links to Benami properties in the land deal is concerned. That is in itself, uh, uh, I, mean, uh, I mean, also an additional proof as well as the visuals that are speaking that we will in the time to come see him and Sorain being arrested by the enforcement directorate. All right, so there, uh, my colleague Shreya Chatterjee, uh, right now standing outside uh, the chief minister's residence. And, you know, in terms of if visuals could speak, like she's just suggested, it seems uh, an arrest is imminent. Our sources, uh, Munish, as he told you, uh, within the ED, have elucidated to us that, yes, it's the final round of questioning, but the ED is not happy with the answers that Heyman Sorain has given pertaining to the land scam. This, this particular summon, though the ED viewers is investigating uh, the chief minister of Jharkhand in three separate cases, but this particular summon came in where the land mafia or uh, the land scam is concerned. And if an arrest is made, then at least on paper, that arrest would be pertaining to the land scam. Uh, where Hemant uh, Sorain's role comes into question. Having said that, in midst of all of this, in midst of these dramatic visuals that we are seeing right outside uh, the chief minister's residence, all our sources are telling us that an arrest is imminent. Hemant Sorain under PMLA will be taken in custody by the enforcement directorate and with the PMLA involved, viewers, you can well understand that uh, the charges are grave and serious and Mr. Sorain is in trouble. But is his government in trouble? That's the big question that needs to be answered. Well, uh, sitting legislators of the JMM-led coalition, the Congress and the RJD are part of this coalition in Jharkhand, have asked time from the governor at 7.55. So that meeting would be just about beginning where the governor is concerned. What is in play, we have been given to understand, it seems that Heman Sorain's uh, wife, uh, Kalpana Sorain, could very well be the new chief minister of Jharkhand. The sitting MLAs of the JMM-led coalition will be taking, as per our sources, uh, uh, that uh, proposal to the governor. And it could very well be that Kalpana Sorain might be taking over as the chief minister if the arrest is made. And in all probabilities, it does seem that arrest is imminent. Shreya, you know, getting you back into the conversation while we also try and touch base with Anupam, who's going to break it down uh, politically, what this means. Heman Sorain, in all probability, as per our sources, as per at least what the optics seem to suggest, is going to be taken in by the enforcement directorate very soon. The question is what happens where his government is in question. Kalpana Sorain's name has been making the rounds. The sitting MLAs have asked for time where the governor is concerned. They are meeting him right now as we speak. Is Kalpana Sorain the probable chief minister of Jharkhand? Uh, Preeti, you know, we we saw the JMM uh, and the ruling alliance MLA seeking time from the governor. Initially, that was 7.50. There's a slight change in time. And now the governor will meet them uh, between 9 and 9.30. We also need to understand that this delay in time is possibly happening to ensure that the law and order situation is also intact. 
Uh, that's probably why we're seeing a little bit delay in the official proceedings of what we are following to see. Uh, there have been multiple rounds of meetings that have already been held at the CM residence. One of the meetings is where we saw Heman Sorin uh, come, uh, I mean, out, out of that uh, 40 hours of missing uh, in action. In these meetings, so far the MLA is coming out, they did not give an official confirmation. But we do have source-based information that Kalpana Sorin's name is something that has been suggested for uh, the position of the change of guard. But there's also another name in concern, which is the name of Champai Sorain. So two names are doing the rounds. Who are the ones possible to take the change of guard? The reason so, if there's a legal hurdle that arrives for Kalpana Sorain, because remember, she's not a sitting MLA, she'll have to win an election. So if at all there is a legal hurdle, there is a second name that has been put in place, that is Champai Sorain's name, for uh, the possibility of becoming the next Chief Minister of Jharkhand. And that's the reason every work has been done at the end of the JMM ruling alliance. They are also ensuring that when he is arrested very smoothly they just finish the paperwork as quickly as possible so that there's no possibility or time given for any defection moment he's arrested we'll see the MLA's buses have been parked inside uh, and it's very important to understand uh, the entire geography of this place now the entire compound at one residence uh, the uh, chief minister is being questioned uh, just a wall separated we are having the MLA's uh, actually placed at the other residence. So they are all on standby at the same location. As and when Heman Sorin will be taken by the Enforcement Directorate, we will be seeing the Emily is moving to the Raj Bhavan. They've already sought the time. They will proceed with the paperwork and see that they also start the work for the change of the government as soon as possible to ensure so, that there or, is no defection. Right, so, so two names right now that is uh, that are making the rounds are Champai Sorain and uh, Kalpana Sorain. Interesting because there's been, at least what our sources tell us, a possible split in terms of who the MLAs are supporting. The JMM-led coalition also has the RJD and the Congress, of course, understandably, all alliance partners standing strong together right now. But will there be defections involved? Uh, the political uh, dynamics of the state of Jharkhand would be very keenly watched over the next course of a couple of hours, viewers, while the final round of questioning is taking place at the Chief Minister's residence. Like we pointed out, Section 144 is in place. Uh, massive security arrangements have been made. In all probability, Heman Sorain, the sitting Chief Minister of Jharkhand, would be going to uh, will be arrested by the Enforcement Directorate this evening itself. Anupam is now back with us. Anupam, break it down for us, the political fallout of what now seems like an imminent arrest. Who will take over as the Chief Minister of the state of Jharkhand? Uh, sought, uh, you know, the sitting MLAs, where the coalition led by the JMM is concerned, have sought time from the governor. Now between 9 to 9.30 is when that time is given, primarily looking at the situation unfolding at the chief minister's residence because the official word of an arrest is yet to come in. What we are being indicated and told is the final round of questioning is going on, but an arrest is imminent. So who will be the next chief minister? of uh, Jharkhand, Anupam. Will it be Kalpana Sorain or Champai Sorain? Because at least where the MLAs of JMM are concerned, there's a split on to who will they support if Heman Sorain is indeed arrested by the ED. Well, Priti, just, uh, let me just update you that uh, Champai Surain just left this gate, uh, the CM's residence. We are standing at the back gate of CM's residence, and he just left from this uh, residence. And we, we, we wanted to ask something, but uh, he didn't answer us. So uh, I think it's over uh, because the na two names which were circulating were Kalpana Surain and Champai Surain. So uh, the, 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 the final name, I think, is Kalpana Surain. Now, now vehicles are approaching, vehicles are leaving. So these are the MLS. These are the MLS leaving from leaving from uh, leaving from S S Chief Minister's residence, and we are trying to get. The, these are the two vehicles. These are the two vehicles. All MLS are ahead, there. Go ahead, Anupam. Detail it for us. आप लोग कहाँ जा रहे हैं? आप लोग आप लोग आप लोग कभी कहाँ राज्य में जा रहे हैं? So they are not answering, but they are leaving. Gadi, gadi bula jaldi, gadi molo. They, are lo they, they have just left CM's residence and they are leaving. They are going towards Raj Bhavan. This is the road going leading towards Raj Bhavan. So I think the time the, which was given around 9. So they, they have left to Raj Bhavan. Champai Soren has already, already left earlier. And then the three vehicles which went inside Chief Minister's residence, uh, they have taken all the MLAs to the Raj Bhavan. All right. So, Priti. Oh, okay. So these are dramatic visuals that are coming in, viewers. It seems an...
announcement of an arrest will be made any time now and at the same time not even leaving a minute anupam not even a minute to chance the mlas all bundled up in three buses you saw those three mini buses leave for the governor's residence mr cp radhakrishnan's residence uh, in ranchi and do they have a decision is the big question anupam kalpana soren uh, there might be a bit of a hurdle because she's not a sitting mla but aside from that it seems that it is her name that is going to be suggested as the next chief minister correct me if i'm wrong or is champai soren also in the running It's not clear yet, but uh, I think it's Kalpana Suren because two names were circul circulating from yesterday, Champai Suren and Kalpana Suren. So let's see. They have already moved towards uh, Governor House, and they will be meeting Governor, and that there will be change of guard. Uh, so the process of changing the guard has okay. already been started, and the all MLAs they have left. Okay, Anupam, I'm going to you know Anupam, I know you've got a you've got to leave for the Governor's residence to get in all the news. We're going to let go of Anupam, my colleague there. but uh, where all the mlas are concerned of the 81 assembly uh, it's uh, 49 where the coalition comes in together of the jmm 29 congress 16 the rjd and the ncp have one each uh, and it is a coalition which is standing together right now and all those mlas bundled up in those three mini buses that you saw have make are making their way to the governor cp radhakrishnan's residence in ranchi viewers there they are going to moot a particular name there were a split earlier where the mlas were concerned on who would they support if heman soren is indeed arrested and what coming in seems to suggest the same so will it be champai soren or kalpana soren in all probability our sources confirming to us viewers that it will be kalpana soren who will now take over reins from her husband to be the chief minister of jharkhand mind you do not miss the history in all of this this is history in the making for the first time a uh, sitting chief minister being arrested by the enforcement directorate in this particular case viewers uh, you did see a dramatic 48 hours because at one point of time there was an indication that nobody really could trace him and so in of course he was found he held in his uh, a meeting with his mlas but uh, you know it was a dramatic 48 hours for the chief minister from delhi all the way back to ranchi i want to just bring in my colleague shreya back into this conversation shreya you know lots going on right now one particular visual playing out in front of the chief minister's residence where any moment from now what we will hear is news of an imminent arrest is what our sources are telling us the final round of questioning going on on the other a new window opens up and that is the visuals coming in from the governor's residence uh, because three buses loaded with the mlas 49 mlas of uh, the jmm led coalition in jharkhand sneaking its way even before an official announcement is made of an arrest so not trying to lose even a moment there uh, you know in case there are defections in case there is a split because already there was seemingly a split on who the mlas wanted to for to take over as the chief minister in case heman soren was arrested Well, absolutely, Preeti. And uh, as the entire scene proceeds, we will also be seeing a lot of drama unfold. Because while uh, this entire arrest take place, the JMM and the ruling alliance would also not leave any stone unturned to ensure that they have the amount of sympathy uh, uh, for their uh, sitting chief minister and de facto chief of the JMM uh, being arrested by the enforcement directorate. Because including JMM, all the opposition in the country continue to maintain that uh, the. action by the central agencies are only vendetta politics that is coming at the behest of the central government so that will also be playing out right now when we actually see them make their movement to uh, the raj bhavan mm -hmm. now as we talk preeti i'm also seeing um, the uh, the security apparatus the Uh, the police officials are lining up one by one uh, they are almost uh, going to be on standby right now and as uh, the movement happens on the other side of the very same compound we are right now seeing uh, an uh, possible action now uh, very soon expected at this end this is the very gate from which the enforcement director team at 130 entered to question heman soren it's almost going to be 7 hours now and we will be seeing right now an official confirmation coming in as we were suggesting the possible delay is only to ensure that the law and order situation is not disrupted because barely 3 kilometers from this area at the morabadi ground we had of uh, information that some of the protesters and supporters of the jmm are also 
right now camping. So to ensure that law and order is not disrupted, uh, the entire precaution is being taken of the timing also uh, when the official confirmation of the arrest comes in. All right, and that could be any time right now, viewers. So, you know, dramatic developments taking place. Uh, uh, those visuals coming in from uh, the chief minister's house uh, in Ranchi, you can see the enforcement directorate cars pulling in section 144 in place in a 100 meter diameter across not just the chief minister's residence, but also the governor's house. Those visuals that are coming in right now, uh, we'll just play those out, are the MLAs of uh, the JMM-led coalition in Jharkhand. So who's the name that has finally been decided? Lots of murmurs, uh, especially speculation. Earlier on, it was indicated there could be a split in the Sorain family where Sita Sorain, the wife of uh, the older son of uh, Shibu Sorain, stating, staking claim and suggesting that, uh, you know, even she had a right and the rightful heir was only Heyman Sorain, which they agreed to. And if it's somebody else, it's not uh, acceptable. But all of that now aside, viewers, it does seem uh, the sitting MLAs have a name in place. And uh, Anupam, have you been able to speak to any of these MLAs who were bundled up in those minivans and taken to the governor's house? Who is going to take over the reins in case Heyman Sorain is arrested this evening? Well, Preeti, we tried, but they uh, did not uh, speak to us, and we have followed them and reached Governor House. This is the Governor House. They just went ahead inside the Governor House, and we have seen Champai Soren also. Le Champai Soren was leading the uh, convoy, the uh, buses, and uh, it, th 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 there are two names: Champai Soren and Kalpana Soren. So I suppose Kalpana Soren will be there, but but not not finalized. So it, uh, um, I, I suppose that when they come out from Governor House, they will do some kind of press conference or they will at least uh, tell us the, what, what happens because the process of changing the baton has already started. The process of giving the letter has already started and all the uh, coalition-led uh, uh, MLAs, the, all the Mahagadban MLAs were there. Uh, they, they, they were bundled. They were packed in three buses, two 24-seater uh, seat, buses and one traveler. And Champai Soren was in his car. So this, this was the scenario when we uh, followed them and they have just entered. So I think the process of changing the baton has already been started. All right, so the change of guard right now. Will it be Champai Soren? Will it be Kalpana Soren? Anupam suggests in all probability the seal of approval has been Kalpana Soren, who is the wife of the sitting chief minister, Heyman Soren, in case he gets arrested. Uh, there is going to be a little bit of a uh, you know, a loophole in that because uh, Kalpana Sorin is not a sitting MLA. She'll need to fight an election and come back. But that all aside, right now it seems the name is uh, being finalized and the letter has been grafted. And now that change of guard taking place inside where the governor's residence is concerned. All of that, Anupam, even while there is no official announcement whether Heyman Sorin has been arrested, what we have been given is final round of questioning still on. Exactly. There, there is no official announcement from ED that Heman Soren is arrested. But what we are uh, getting the sense that he will be arrested soon. The an official uh, uh, official statement will be uh, made by ED uh, soon. So that will happen soon. But here in uh, Governor House, there is another process going on. And uh, as you said, Kalpana, if, if they choose Kalpana Soren, then she'll have to fight an election. And, and one uh, uh, MLA, Sarfraz, has already been resigned. So so th th that, that is the seat from where Kalpana will be uh, fighting. And if, if Champai will be there, so th then th there will be another case. So, But we will know uh, b b in, in, in a few moments that what, what is going on inside Raj Bhavan. You know, Anupam, you know, for, for just a brief while, let's just uh, look away from the ED questioning Heyman Sorain and an arrest eminent, but just the politics in the absence of Heyman Sorain. Because earlier on, the BJP closely watching developments in the state of Jharkhand. There seemed to be a rift within the Sorain family as well, with Sita Sorain coming in. And that could have been seen because of the 49 MLAs, only 35 showed for the meeting yesterday with uh, Heyman Sorain. So will that family rift also play out in days to come or that is settled now? 
Indeed, there was discontent uh, within the family, especially Sita Surin and Basant Surin, but, and that discontent will be there, uh, but it depends on how Kalpana Surin or, or maybe Champai Surin uh, manage this discontent or uh, if, if, if this discontent gets wider, then it will it'll, it'll, it'll be, uh, it'll be uh, split into the uh, coalition government, especially in JMM. But for the uh, time being, what, uh, uh, what we know that yesterday the meeting which lasted for more than then two hours. One thing was decided that they will be, uh, they will, they will have to be united because they wanted to stop the poaching, uh, and and that was the final verdict which was given uh, to the MLAs to say to the uh, uh, media. And uh, every every MLA who who was coming out from the uh, residence of Chief Minister after the meeting was saying that we have decided to stay uh, together. So that is what uh, Heman Suren is successfully done. Uh, he has kept all the MLAs in a circuit house, all the uh, coalition-led government, and now the all coalition-led uh, MLAs have uh, came together inside the governor house. So that is what Himan Suren has successfully done. And right now, uh, we'll have to see uh, the discontent which is there inside the family. All right, okay, Anupam, we are breaking news. Champai Soren will be the next chief minister of Jharkhand in case. Uh, Hemant Soren is arrested. That's the latest news coming in right now. And I want to pull in Anupam back into the conversation because the MLAs had prepared two letters. One was Kalpana Soren, the other one Champai Soren. What coming in right now, Anupam, is that it is indeed Champai Soren who will take over reins when and if Hemant Soren is arrested by the Enforcement Directorate this evening. Well, we have seen that Champai Suren was leading the convoy. He was uh, in front of the uh, buses which left the CM's residence. And uh, uh, last night, when we were spoke, uh, we were speaking to other members of the uh, other. Uh, look, the vehicles are coming back. The vehicles are coming out from Raj Bhavan, and this is the first vehicle. And Champai Suren, it might be Champai Suren who was leading uh, the this convoy. Uh, he he might be in the first vehicle, and other uh, three buses are there behind the. Bus us and the all the all the buses all the uh, leaders have came out from the uh, governor house and they are uh, heading towards i think uh, maybe they will say something the the convoy has stopped in front of uh, the gate of uh, raj bhavan uh, the first vehicle is approaching uh, and mlas are there inside the bus the uh, windows are closed uh, the movement is very slow they are not rushing uh, the way we have seen that they rushed from CM's residence. So there might be any press conference or might be uh, someone coming out from uh, that uh, uh, vehicle and will brief uh, media here out uh, at Raj Bhavan. So these three buses are there and we will try to get you every conversation which uh, we are getting from these uh, leaders out here. But they have stopped. They, they have stopped and we don't know where they will be heading at present. But they are together, the three buses. Okay, okay, someone is, I think someone will come out. I think, I think there is something happening. Thoda side ho I think they... Oh, aa rahe All right, so lots of uh, in the so melee. There will be yeah, go ahead, conference. go ahead, Anupam. Yeah, so so I think there will be a press conference. They are uh, choosing a leader. It might be Champai Soren who will uh, do a press conference. That is why they have stopped here. And we will know the official version of uh, Jharkhand Mukti Morcha and coalition-led government, what they have done inside and how they are preparing and what what happens if, if uh, Heman Soren uh, gets arrested and what is the other way or what are the strategies they are trying to cooperate and there is one more vehicle is approaching and and here Heman Soren CM Heman Soren getting inside getting inside governor house CM Heman Soren getting inside governor house so this is the first visual of Heman Soren today that he was Right, he was getting Anupam, what you're telling us is that the Priti. sitting chief minister, Heman Soren's cavalcade, has just pulled in to the governor's house. Is he accompanied by ED officials? 
because clearly he would be stepping down now earlier on viewers which was yesterday in deft political maneuvering the jharkhand chief minister hemant soren had secured at that point of time uh, the signatures of jmm mlas on two blank papers during that meeting one was supposed to be for kalpana soren and the other one for champai soren support for champai soren and support for kalpana soren what is coming in right now that it is champai soren who has been picked by the mlas to lead the jmm led coalition if hemant soren is arrested let's uh, once again dip in and uh, get anupam back into the conversation anupam over to you hemant soren is he accompanied by ed officials over to you hear me all right we're going to we're going to try and get through to my colleague uh, anupam in just about a short while but that's a cavalcade that is pulling in it has hemant soren in it is he accompanied by ed officials uh, he's come into the governor's house he'd be stepping down in all probability uh, champai soren is now the next chief minister of jharkhand that transfer of power has happened uh, earlier on uh, okay there seems to be now um, an a press conference of sorts The MLAs are walking out one by one, and it seems they are going to be addressing Abhi. the media. Listen it. बताइए बताइए क्या राज्य की क्या स्थिति है? अभी सर्वसम्मति से चंपाई सरन को सदन का नेता दल का नेता हम लोगों ने चुन लिया है मुख्यमंत्री के रूप में और महामहिम इसका प्रक्रिया सरकार गठन का करे हम लोग यही राजनीतिक स्थिति है अभी सो दैट वॉज द ऑफिशियल वर्जन ऑफ जे एम एम चंपाई सोरेन हैज बीन चोजन द लीडर ऑफ द कॉलिशन ओके चंपाई सोरेन वी वॉज द सिटिंग मिनिस्टर ऑफ ट्रांसपोर्ट शेड्यूल ट्राइब शेड्यूल कास्ट एंड बैकवर्ड क्लास वेलफेयर has been designated the chief minister uh, of uh, the state of jharkhand his name is on the name which the mlas have arrived on there could be a deputy in all of this viewers there could very well be a deputy in all of this we're going to try and get in an understanding congress could indeed get their deputy cm in all of this because out of the 81 assembly seat uh, where झारखंड हम लोग सभी लोग एक साथ हैं सारे लोग यहाँ उपस्थित हैं क्या सिर्फ बदलने की बात सामने आ रही है क्या चेहरे बदलने की बात के चेहरे बदलने की सोच देखिए सभी विधायक आयु so 49 viewers 49 mlas ka are of the jmm led coalition of it if we break it up jmm has 29 congress 16 ncp rjd left one each having said that there is word coming in that in this dispensation there could very well be a deputy chief minister also and the congress could get that deputy cm ship having said that champai soren now is the next chief minister of jharkhand or at least the transfer of power has happened where the mlas are concerned you saw the cavalcade of uh, those buses and minivans pulling in of uh, the 49 mlas of the jmm led coalition in jharkhand and they have suggested that their next leader is going to be champai soren um, champai soren is uh, the minister of tribal welfare uh, transport scheduled tribe backward class welfare as well and he will now be leading the jmm coalition in the state of jharkhand if at all and when hemant soren is arrested in midst of all of this hemant soren has also reached the governor's house will he be officially stepping down was he accompanied by ed officials after stepping down will the ed announce that he has been officially arrested because till now viewers you know in midst of all the theatrics the politics of it all the drama that you see uh, there is no official confirmation and we must reiterate that right now hemant soren has yet karaye chaliye piche chaliye ho gaya bas ho gaya piche ho gaya raj ke wakile mukhyamantri honge 
All right. So what you're hearing in from ground, Champai Soren will be the next chief minister of the state of Jharkhand. So, you know, I'll, I'll once again give you the sequence of events. After six and a half hours of questioning, the final round of questioning was taking place outside the chief minister's residence in Ranji, who was Heyman Soren. Section 144 in a diameter of 100 meters was imposed. Over 7,000 police personnel have been deployed all across strategic points in the state of Jharkhand. High alert, the ED called for backup. So our sources also indicated that in all probability an arrest of Heyman Soren would be made in midst of that just about 20 minutes ago. Three buses laden with the uh, MLAs of the JMM-led coalition in Jharkhand, 49 of them, uh, all of them making their way uh, to the governor's residence. And at that residence, uh, very clearly, uh, the MLAs uh, gave a name of uh, Champai Soren. Champai Soren would be the next chief minister of the state of uh, Jharkhand viewers and uh, with that decision yesterday, it was in-depth political maneuvering. Heyman Soren had taken the signatures of his MLAs on a blank paper. Uh, two separate papers were made. One possibly for Kalpana Soren, his wife, the other Champai Soren. And it seems that the MLAs, uh, that the JMM uh, coalition MLAs have decided that Champai Soren would be leading the coalition in the absence of Heyman Soren. Also, what has happened is that while the MLAs made their way to the governor's office, C.P. Radhakrishnan's uh, uh, governor's house, on the other hand, you had the cavalcade pull in with Mr. Heyman Soren. So, will he be stepping down and then possibly an official announcement of an arrest be made? We are going to try and get in a larger understanding with all the developments as and when they take place. But... Uh, Dramatic developments on what you see. Our MLA is standing outside the governor's office. They've confirmed governor's residence. They've come out confirmed that their next chief minister is going to be Champai Soren. But inside right now, Heyman Soren is in the governor's at the governor's residence, uh, possibly stepping down. And maybe then we will hear a formal arrest of uh, Heyman Soren by the enforcement directorate. To put this, let's listen in to all reactions. लोग प्रस्तुत करेंगे सारे विधायक हमारे साथ हैं विधायकों को अंदर पहले जाने दिया गया फिर बाहर किया गया अब ये देखते हैं कि राज्यपाल महोदय अगर बुलाएंगे तो हम लोग सारे विधायकों के साथ परेड कर पाएंगे नहीं बुलाना ही है संवैधानिक पद पर बैठे हुए कोई घर की बात थोड़ी जो है जो भी करना है ठोक के करना है और सबको अपना अपना दायरा पता है नहीं देखिए कोई सहमति आप लोगों की वो कहानी थी काल्पनिक कहानी कल्पना जी के बारे में वो चंपाई सोरेन को चुन लिया है गवर्नर क्या कह रहे हैं क्यों कहा जा रहा है कि हम लोगों को इंसल्ट किया गया बेजत किया गया क्या कह रहे हैं तमाम विधायक ये कह रहे हैं कि हम लोगों को इंटरटेन नहीं किया जा रहा और क्या कर रहे हैं मैंने जानता हूँ मैं इस भाषा का प्रयोग फिजिकल परेड वगैरह भी हुआ क्या अंदर अभी कुछ नहीं हुआ है आप लोगों को टाइम नहीं मिला नहीं अभी नहीं मिला अभी वो प्रक्रिया है अभी भैया हो जाए क्या अभी नहीं आप लोग जाके वापस आ गए अब आप क्या सर प्लान आप लोग सर्किट हाउस में ही रुकेंगे एक साथ अब जहाँ ले जाएगा सर्किट हाउस में पुराना सर्किट हाँ पुराना देखिए जहाँ आया तो वहाँ बोला कहाँ बोल रहा है आप लोग क्यों आई भाई विधार so, word has just come in from the governor's house that uh, Heyman Soren has resigned from the chief ministership of the state of Jharkhand. The JMM uh, coalition, the MLAs, 49 MLAs, have picked Champai Soren to lead them now that uh, Heyman Soren has stepped down. But dramatic developments taking place because you saw those bus loads of MLAs make their way to the governor's residence and being turned away. They haven't been given time yet. But they've come out and declared to the press even before that formal switchover or the change of guard or change of power.
takes place, that image coming in, Hemant Sorain uh, giving the thumbs up there as he makes his way to the governor's house and resigns. Hemant Sorain has resigned as Jharkhand Chief Minister, viewers. That would mean an arrest has been made. One can. और हमने अपना नया नेता चंपाई सोरेन जी को चुना है विधायक दल का नेता और हम महामहिम राजपाल महोदय से प्रार्थना करने आए हैं कि नई सरकार के गठन के लिए वो चंपाई सोरेन जी को मुख्यमंत्री के रूप में शपथ दिलाएं और नई सरकार के गठन के मार्ग को प्रशस्त करें और ये संवैधानिक व्यवस्था जो पूर्व में चली आ रही है उस व्यवस्था को वो लागू रखें। तो गवर्नर क्या एंटरटेन नहीं कर रहे हैं क्या कहा गवर्नर ने गवर्नर साहब ने पांच लोगों को मिलने का समय दिया है अभी नौ पचास के आसपास का समय है तो उसमें हमारे आलमगीर साहब जाएंगे सत्यानंद भोक्ता जी जाएंगे और हमारे और तीन उसमें विनोद सिंह जी वगैरह लोग जाएंगे थैंक यू ऑल राइट ओके सो द गवर्नर हैज गिवन दम टाइम येट But before that, Hemant Sorain has stepped down, viewers. So even though there is no official announcement of an arrest of the chief minister, who is no longer the chief minister because he's resigned, one can safely say that Hemant Sorain will be arrested now by the ED. There are no two ways. He stepped down as chief minister. That arrest will be made, and Champai Sorain will be the next chief minister. Of the state of कोई जानकारी आई नहीं है जिस वक्त जानकारी आएगी तभी हम लोग ऑथेंटिक कर सकते हैं कि नौ पचास के आसपास इंटरटेनमेंट तो है नहीं मंत्री जी को लेकर ईडी की टीम अंदर गई है और उसके बाद सब लोग यहाँ सारे विधायक लोग यहाँ वेट कर रहे हैं जैसे जैसा खबर आएगा उसके हिसाब से फिर आगे की तो इस्तीफा सौंपेंगे हेमंत सोरेन और चंपई सोरेन का लेटर लेके आप लोग जा रहे हैं जी ऐसा ही ऐसी बात हुई कितने लोग हैं आप लोग कितने एम एल एज है संख्या बल पूरा है पूरा 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 संख्या बल है पूरा से भी ज्यादा से भी ज्यादा है तो ये एक जो बहुत बात आ रही थी कल्पना सोरेन या फिर चंपाई सोरेन तो अंत में चंपाई अभी तो यही बात हुई है कि चंपाई सोरेन जी को ही मुख्यमंत्री बनाया जाएगा और किस तरह से देख रहे हैं हेमंत सोरेन की गिरफ्तारी को ये क्या पॉलिटिकल वेंडेटा है या क्या आ, ये तो देखिए बहुत दिनों से ये सब चल ही रहा था और लोग जान ही रहे थे कि इस तरह से कुछ किया जा सकता है तो पार्टी की तरफ से पूरी तैयारी भी थी इसकी वैकल्पिक व्यवस्था थी लेकिन जो भी हुआ बहुत दुखद है लोकतंत्र के इतिहास में ऐसा नहीं होना चाहिए था अभी राज्यपाल ऐसी क्या उम्मीद है की वो आप लोगों को बुलाएंगे अगर नहीं होना चाहिए जब संख्या बल है तो फिर राज्यपाल महोदय क्या करेंगे निश्चित रूप से रोक दिया गया आप लोग तो भीतर भी गए थे हाँ अभी रोक दिया गया है अभी इस्तीफा नहीं हुआ था शायद इसीलिए तो सब लोग यही इंतजार कर रहे हैं विधायकगण कि जैसी स्थिति बनेगी तुरंत वहाँ जाए जाएगा ईडी की टीम के साथ हेमंत सोरेन गए हैं अभी अभी अंदर गए हैं तो हेमंत सोरेन तो अब गिरफ्तार किए जाएंगे कोर्ट में पेश किया जाएगा एक जो आशंका जताई जा रही है लॉ एंड ऑर्डर की सिचुएशन प्रॉब्लम हो सकती है सरकार चुकी है अभी आपकी है तो ऐसे में इससे किस तरह से निपटा जाए नहीं सारा इंस्ट्रक्शन पहले से दिया हुआ है कार्यकर्ताओं को भी बोला गया है अनुशासन में रहा जाए तो मुझे नहीं लगता है कि ऐसी कोई व्यवस्था पता नहीं अब बता नहीं सकते लोग इंडिविजुअल कोई अगर डिसीजन ले तो लेकिन पार्टी की तरफ से तो सबको संयमित रहने के लिए आदेश दिया गया है तो ऐसा कुछ नहीं होने की आशंका है जिस तरह आज भी हमने देखा काफी जो पहले हुआ था वैसा नहीं तरफ से माननीय मुख्यमंत्री जी की तरफ से हमेशा शांत और संयमित रहने के लिए बोला गया है कार्यकर्ता जो कुछ कर रहे हैं अपनी मर्जी से कर रहे हैं ठीक है ठीक है ठीक है तो महुआ माझी उन्होंने स्पष्ट कर दिया हमारे साथ बातचीत में की उन्हें अभी रोका गया है और भीतर में भीतर में हेमंत सोरेन गए हैं और हमारे साथ दूसरे भी विधायक है यहाँ पर हम बात करने की कोशिश करेंगे आज तक से हूँ किस तरह की स्थिति आप लोगों को अभी रोका गया हेमंत सोरेन को गिरफ्तार किया जा रहा है तो ऐसे में क्या कहेंगे देखिए मेरे को लगता है कि कानून का आ, साथ दिया जा रहा है कानून के हिसाब से चला जा रहा है और हमें जुडिशरी पे पूरा भरोसा है और आ, जो भी चीजें हो रही है सारा चीज आपके सामने है कोई भी चीज आपसे छुपी हुई नहीं है और आ, जो भी हो रहा है गलत हो रहा है यही कैसे सोरेन के नाम पर सब सहमत है जी हमने हम सब ने मिलकर उनको अपनी विधायक दल का नेता सब चुना है सब हम लोग की सहमति से उनका नाम चुना गया एक, एक आप लोग पहले भी गए थे भीतर रोक दिया गया अभी क्या आपको उम्मीद है भीतर में गवर्नर साहब आपको बुलाएंगे जब इस्तीफा दे दिया जाएगा संख्या बल आपके पास हम लोग सब आपके सामने हैं और क्या होगा क्या नहीं होगा वो सब हमें पता भी नहीं है पर हम तो अपना संघर्ष कर रहे हैं और जो संवैधानिक जो नियम है जो संवैधानिक अधिकार है उसके तहत हम लोग आए हैं
और जिस तरीके की राजनीति आप अभी देख रही हैं झारखंड में हो रही है उस पर क्या कहेंगे मैं बस यही कहूंगी कि जो हो रहा है वो गलत हो रहा है गिरफ्तारी पर आप कह रही हैं गलत हुआ है ए टू जेड जितनी भी चीजें आपको दिखाई दे रही है जिस तरह से दिख रही है जो दिख रही है मुझे लगता है कि इस तरह से नहीं होना चाहिए बिल्कुल हमसे बात करने के लिए बहुत बहुत शुक्रिया ममता जी थी और इस वक्त और भी कई नेता हमारे साथ देखिए सीधी बात है कि हमारे मुख्यमंत्री जी ने निर्णय लिया है कि हम इस्तीफा देंगे उस नाते वो राजभवन में आए हैं राज्यपाल से मिलकर इस्तीफा देंगे और नए मुख्यमंत्री के रूप में हम लोगों ने चंपई सोरेन को अपना नेता चुना है वो मुख्यमंत्री का हम लोग दावा करते हैं बिल्कुल सभी विधायक जाना चाहते थे रोका गया है जब वो बुलाएंगे तो फिर जाएंगे and uh, we were all called to rajbhavan we, we we got time to come and see the governor but when they saw the numbers i think they cannot uh, tolerate a, a, a stable a government of majority and so they just sent us back how how much families are there with you all of us are there except one ramdas orenji is sick and hospitalized and he is undergoing a transplant kidney transplant there, there was a discontent a report of discontent going on between uh, the family sita See, these these are all rumors planted by bjp uh, nothing uh, was discussed in the last two days we have we also have been seeing the uh, breaking news those were all speculations and had nothing to do with reality and in in, in the meeting the name of champai soren was chosen today or it was chosen today. itself yesterday okay today so there was no discussion yesterday on the no, name of uh, alternate not at all not at all Okay, and and uh, how do you see the politics? Do you see the arrest? This is this is very shameful. ये बहुत ही derogatory है and we are very humiliated. We shouldn't have been uh, treated like this by the Rajpal. बिल्कुल बहुत humiliated महसूस कर रही हैं वो और यहाँ पर जिस तरीके से खड़े हुए हैं JMM के विधायक वो कोशिश कर रहे हैं कि वो भीतर जाएं और उनको बुलाया जाए. Okay, viewers. Let's quickly get you up to speed with the very latest that is coming in that uh, window that you see. Those visuals right in the middle. That's Heman Soren, who has entered the governor's uh, residence. He's tendered in his resignation. He is no longer the chief minister of Jharkhand, which clearly implies, viewers, that Heman Soren will be arrested by the ED. Uh, it's only a matter of making it official. The sheer fact he's tendered in his resignation means he will be arrested. On the other hand. You've had uh, the MLAs uh, of the JMM-led coalition, uh, 49 of them. There are 48 in terms of the strength, uh, where 28 or 28 in attendance. There are 29 of the JMM, 28 are here. 16 of the Congress, NCP left, and the RJD with one each. All of them coming into the governor's residence and mooting the name of Champai Soren to lead them after Hemant Soren. He will be the next chief minister. of the state of jharkhand but having said that the governor hasn't yet given them time the mla is saying that they are feeling humiliated because they haven't been given time maybe it's just a matter of procedure protocol hemant soren has come in tendered in his resignation and now the mlas are waiting to seek an audience with the governor so they can give in the letter of support for champai soren now who is champai soren in all of this viewers um, of course he is a cabinet minister where the jmm government is concerned he comes in from sarai kela jharkhand that's his constituency he's the vice president of the jmm uh, called the jharkhand tiger uh, is a son of a farmer uh, a, a mass leader of sorts uh, you know where jmm is concerned and jharkhand is concerned is said to be close to the soren family and yesterday and i want to bring in polumi is with us into this conversation yesterday polumi uh hemant soren had got the signatures of his mlas on two blank papers one was what we speculated his own wife uh, for kalpana soren the other champai soren and it seems champai soren it is who will now take over the reins as and when that official announcement is made by the ed that hemant soren is arrested who himself now has tendered in his resignation That's right. Uh, earlier, of course, uh, we reported and we broke this uh, that you know there were two sets of letters uh, that JMM MLAs, in fact, signed on uh, in that meeting. Seven MLAs, of course, were missing from uh, that meeting. Twenty-nine of them, of course, you count Hemant Soren out of that. So twenty-eight of them. 
21 of them, of course, signed on that two sets of letters, one with Kalpana Soren's name and one with Champai Soren's name. Champai Soren, again, a long associate of uh, Shibu Soren, has, uh, you know, uh, fought the Jharkhand uh, Morcha. Uh, you know, the uh, movement to have a separate state with Shibu Soren and then has been associated with the Jharkhand Mukti Mocha known as Jharkhand Ka Tiger as well. So it has been very crucial in the way that he has, of course, you know, been part of uh, uh, the party and of course uh, with uh, the family with Shibu Soren all of this uh, time. So it has of course uh, come as no surprise that he has been picked because at the end of the day, you know, there was a lot of resistance that was coming in from within the family itself, from Basan Soren, from Sita Soren. We've of course uh, heard from them uh, that, you know, they're all there and only one MLA is missing as they go to the governor to in fact, uh, you know, say that Champai Soren has been elected leader of the legislative party of uh, the JMN. Uh, Pulumi, will you stay but with me? You know, the news that we're breaking right now is uh, that one of the MLAs from the JMM, uh, Mahua Maji, has confirmed to India today that Heman Soren has indeed been arrested. JMM MP uh, Mahua has confirmed just a short while ago to India today that Heman Soren has been arrested. This was something that uh, we were saying that was only a matter of protocol now or just to make it official as Heman Soren stepped down, resigned as chief minister, went to the governor's residence. Uh, it was imminent and now that confirmation coming in from one of his own party leaders, uh, MP Mahua Maji, who's come out and said that that arrest has happened. Of course, nothing coming in from the enforcement directorate just yet. Uh, the MLA is now, Polumi, waiting for an audience with the governor. Uh, they had gone in there but turned away, but now hoping to return with that letter for support of Champai Sore. That's right. Uh, you know, they have, of course, uh, you know, reached uh, the governor's house. Uh, they have, of course, said that they've elected Polumi, uh, Just Champai stay Sore. with me. Po I'm, I'm, apologies, I'm coming in right again. Uh, Banna uh, Gupta, Jharkhand Health Minister, is on the phone line with us. Uh, can you... Confirmed for us, has an arrest been made of Heman Soren? Abhi, Abhi, Hamne Vidayak Dalki Nita Kiru, Adani Champai Soren Ji ko suna hai, aur ham Mahamayim Rajpal Mohde se pratna karte hain ki wo agle mukhyamantri ke roop mein unko jo hai sabd dilaye aur nayi sarkar ka wo गठन करने का मार्ग प्रशस्त है। बन्ना गुप्ता जी जो आपकी एमपी हैं महुआ जी वो कह रही हैं कि अरेस्ट हो चुका है हेमंत सोरेन जी का क्या आप इसकी पुष्टि कर सकते हैं? नहीं अभी तो देखिए अभी तो जब तक पूरा ऑफिशियल नहीं होगा इस पर मैं कोई बहुत अधिकारिक बात नहीं कह सकता। आप बन्ना गुप्ता जी ये बताइए जो आपका पूरा विधायक दल है कितने एमएलएज हैं आप 49 हैं उनमें से क्या आज सारे के सारे गवर्नर हाउस पहुंचे हैं इकट्ठे पहुंचे हैं बिल्कुल सारे विधायक इंटैक्ट हैं और कहीं भी कोई ये बट नहीं है सारे विधायक बिल्कुल मजबूती के साथ ये गठबंधन सरकार में आदरणीय हमारी सोनिया गांधी जी राहुल गांधी जी मल्लिकार्जुन खड़गे साहब के नेतृत्व में हम आ, हमारे चंपाई सोरेन जी को पूर्ण समर्थन देंगे बन्ना गुप्ता जी सुनने में आ रहा है कि कांग्रेस का डेप्यूटी हो सकता है सही बात है गलत अब देखिए ये तो पार्टी के जो प्रभारी हैं या पार्टी के शीर्ष नेतृत्व तय करेंगे इस पर मेरा कुछ भी कहना बहुत उचित नहीं है गवर्नर ने अभी तक आपसे बातचीत क्यों नहीं की है बन्ना गुप्ता जी अब अब करेंगे बातचीत तो करेंगे बातचीत करेंगे देखते हैं बातचीत करेंगे क्या जो कल हेमंत सोरेन जी ने आप सबको बुलाया था क्या दो आ, कोरे कागजों पर आपके हस्ताक्षर लिए गए थे क्योंकि एक वो भी चली थी बात कि कल्पना जी भी हो सकती हैं। नहीं जब हमने विधायक दल के नेता के रूप में चंपा सोरेन जी को चुन लिया तो फिर अब वो ई बट वाली कोई बात ही नहीं है वो तो क्लियर कॉन्सेप्ट है तो क्या गव, गवर्नर के पास आप आज ही रात को जा रहे हैं आपको कुछ उन, उनसे कोई इतला मिली है कोई कॉन्फर्मेशन टाइम का मिला है आ, आ, अब 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 थोड़ी देर बाद बात करेंगे तो मैं बताऊंगा चलिए बन्ना गुप्ता जी बहुत शुक्रिया कि आप हमसे जुड़े वेल द कॉन्फर्मेशन कमिंग इन चंपाई सोरेन विल बी द नेक्स्ट चीफ मिनिस्टर ऑफ झारखंड एटलीस्ट दी एम एल एज एंड विद वॉट द हेल्थ मिनिस्टर टेल्स अस दैट ऑल एम एल एज हैव बिन देर इन अटेंडेंस देव ऑल साइंड इन ऑन चंपाई सोरेन लीडिंग द पार्टी आफ्टर हेमंत सोरेन स्टेप्स डाउन लेट्स क्विकली लिसन इन टू ऑल द रिएक्शन कमिंग इन
इतनी घटनाएं हो रही है तो ऑथेंटिक दो चार मिनट रुकिए अपने आप सामने आएगा ये भविष्य की राजनीति पर असर डालेगा झारखंड में किसकी भविष्य में जो राजनीति होगी विधानसभा लोकसभा के चुनाव में देखिए भाजपा जो है वो निश्चित तौर पे ट्राइबलों के खिलाफ रहा है सी एन टी एस पी टी एक्ट लगा के इनके जमीन का हड़पने का काम कर रहा था रघुवर सर उसके उसका नतीजा है की आज जो है पूरे आदिवासी समाज में गुस्सा है इस सारी चीजों को लेकर भविष्य पे तो निश्चित तौर पे ये जो मनमानी कानून हमने बनाया है ये ईडी का कानून लेकिन इस दिन के लिए नहीं कि सेंट्रल गवर्नमेंट का पॉलिटिकल यूज करके उसका जो है किसी को इवन चीफ मिनिस्टर को भी आप भगोड़ा डिक्लेयर कर बड़ा सवाल क्योंकि आप पुराने नेता हैं चंपई सोरेन भी पुराने नेता क्या जो मुद्दे हैं जो पॉलिटिकल मुद्दे ऊपर खड़े उतर पाएंगे चंपई सोरेन अभी चंपई सोरेन हो या एक्स वाई जेड हो जब तक कोई ओथ लेके मुख्यमंत्री नहीं बनता है आई कान रिया घोषणा हो गई है प्रदेश अध्यक्ष ने भी घोषणा की है कि चंपई सोरेन को हम लोगों ने अपना नेता माना है चंपई सोरेन ही मुख्यमंत्री होंगे आप उनको वो हमारे विधायक परेड करेंगे परेड करने ही के लिए आए हुए थे कि अगर कोई अगर उसकी व्यवस्था है तो वो भी कर ले लेकिन गवर्नर मिलने से ही इनकार कर दिया उन्होंने हेमंत सोरेन जी की मुलाकात होने के बाद उनका इस्तीफा ले लिया बाकी लोगों से मिलने से इनकार कर दिया इनकार कर दिया यस लेकिन यहाँ पर जमीन घोटाले का मामला लगा हुआ है बेहद गंभीर आरोप जमीन जमीन घोटाले गंभीर नहीं होता है मैडम जमीन का मामला मामूली सिविल कोर्ट का मामला होता है उसमें आज तक किसी को हमने गिरफ्तारी नहीं सुनी है और ये क्या हो कि साहब एक लाइन कुछ बोल दे और उसके बाद कहे कि आप इस्तीफा दीजिए तो गिरफ्तार कर लेंगे तो वो इस्तीफा देने क्यों गए अगर उन्होंने गलती नहीं की थी तो फिर इस्तीफा देने के लिए क्यों गए आप जो हो रहा है देश भर में गैर भाजपाई सरकारों के साथ आप नहीं देख रहे कि गिरफ्तार कर लेंगे आपको तो अगर वो दस मिनट के अंदर का जो अभी खेल है की चीफ मिनिस्टर अपना अल्टरनेटिव करके अगर चाहते हैं कि हम आए क्या रुख होता है वो देख लीजिए तो राजभवन ने परेड कराने से इंतजार कर दिया विधायकों का आगे क्या करेंगे आप लोग अब लेट्स वेट हम लोग तो इंतजार करेंगे कि क्या होता है हेमंत जी के अभी आने के बाद वो क्या रिएक्ट और आई सपोज कान सहाय फ्रॉम द कांग्रेस आल्सो देयर व्यूअर्स यू नो वन नीड्स टू पुट दिस इन परस्पेक्टिव बिकॉज इफ यू लुक एट इट द जेएमएम लेड कोलिशन आल्सो हैज 16 Congress MLAs, 29 of the JMM, 16 of the Congress, one each of the RJD left and the NCP. So both can't say hi from the Congress. What is also now coming in? There could possibly be a deputy CM of the Congress in midst of all of this. But the news that we can confirm, it's only to be made official now. Um, Heman Sorain. has been arrested by the enforcement directorate official confirmation from the ed is yet to come in but uh, those visuals that you see uh, his cavalcade pulling in to the governor's uh, house he stepped down he's resigned while now the group of mlas 49 of them of the jmm led coalition waiting uh, to get an audience with the governor to parade their mlas also uh, with the, the letter of support for champai soren champai soren uh, called the tiger of jharkhand the son of a farmer close to the soren family uh, the vice president of the jmm will now be leading the jmm coalition in the state of jharkhand in the absence of heman sorain and uh, historic peers for the first time a sitting chief minister being arrested by the enforcement directorate 